Cool, the another tablet we have here is the Acer Iconia 510. It's a new tablet from Acer as well with Tegra 3 and our uh, quad core SOC. So, again, it's running uh, Ice Cream Sandwich, so in the same way, it's very snappy. The design is in compared to previous version, Alconia is a slimmer, it's a thinner. Actually, I like it very much, it's very good uh, fitting menu holding in the hands. And so, uh, regarding the connectors, you see it's just uh, the standard stuff. And so, uh, as far as I know, this will be sort of soon on the market, so it takes some time, but we can expect it in, in the near future. So, we have uh, here many games playing on it, so I can maybe try to show you something how as fast it is. So, uh, let me check uh, Riptide. Not sure how much I can play it because I actually need to hold it in my hands and it's. Died, but let me try. So it's a Tegra 3 version of the Red Tide GP. If you compare it with Tegra 2, it's uh, way more crisper, more responsive. It's basically running now almost 60 frames per second. Uh, you have these nice water effects if you if you just jump. Let me show it to you. I need to find a platform for the jump. So I, it feels way more smoother in compared to the previous version because uh, the grass 3 looks to me like the right solution for the riptide. So let me just jump out of the water. You see these splashes, these effects. Actually, these are really happening in the real time. So these are basically it's a real-time water simulation, which uh, using uh, one of our cores in the Tegra 3 just for this. That's why it's not possible in the previous dual core CPUs because they don't have enough power to basically simulate uh, the water in that way. I think it's pretty cool.